Working with us, some breaking news. New data shows South Carolina is seeing a dramatic increase in both maternal and infant mortality rates. State health officials are calling the trend alarming. Our Jason Raven tells you what is behind the increase. State health officials say these new numbers show South Carolina still has a lot of work to do on this front, and the data shows disparities in these two metrics. The new report shows that South Carolina's infant mortality rate rose by 12 percent from 2020 to 2021, and the most recent data shows pregnancy-related deaths increased by 9 percent. Most of these children should still be alive today. Um, and most of those moms, if not all of them, should be alive today. A total of 416 infant deaths were reported, the highest in nearly a decade. And for infants born to non-Hispanic black mothers, that rate has grown almost 40 percent since 2017. State health officials say black infants continue to suffer disproportionately, dying at a rate nearly 2.5 times that of white infants. DHEC director Dr. Edward Simmer says access to care and education are issues they are currently working to address. If we're losing over 400 children a year in South Carolina, that's a tragedy. We have to stop that. You know, those those children will never be part of a healthy community. They'll never be part of a family, and that's huge. The South Carolina Maternal Morbidity and Mortality Review Committee found similar disparities in their data. In 2019, 22 pregnancy-related deaths were reported. They say the non-Hispanic black population experienced a 67 percent higher pregnancy-related mortality ratio than their white counterparts in 2018 and 19. Speaking in, in over the general data as a whole, uh, I do think improving access to care, getting these medical issues identified and addressed earlier in the pregnancy would be helpful. And certainly also making sure that children are getting the follow up after they're born. Officials say 82 percent of these pregnancy related deaths were preventable. Currently, there are 14 counties in South Carolina with no OBGYN and some women in rural counties live more than 30 minutes away from prenatal care options. In Columbia, Jason Raven, 7 News. And officials say the state's infant mortality rate is higher than the national average.